I should not be starting this far forward. Welcome to a beautiful and sunny York Park Run. I have the racecourse grandstand just behind me and although we have perfect conditions today for running, unfortunately I have been full of cold all week and there is no way that I'm going to be able to do anything fast. Unfortunately Rory has not been well either, he's carrying his calf injury from Walsall Park Run last weekend. So although we got perfect conditions for a fast run, unfortunately we won't be using that post-marathon fitness to go for an all-out fast time today. So we're just looking forward to enjoying running somewhere new. You can hear it in my throat now. So yeah, come and join us on our attempt to get round York Park Run in one piece and uh, yeah, enjoy the views. Since Walsall Park Run seven days earlier, I'd managed one easy run and one small speed session. Then the cold hit. If I'd have known then how long it would take for this thing to shift, then I'd have taken the same advice I'd given to Rory. This is where we say goodbye to Rory. He's not allowed to go any faster than 10 minute miling today. It turns out there's paces as well today, which is, uh, I don't know whether it's good or bad. Probably not a good idea considering I should really be taking it easy. Firstly, I'd just like to highlight the amazing efforts of all our volunteers. And just going into autopilot, I move my way nearer to the front. I'm sure I'm not the only runner who throws common sense out the window. Here we go, York Park Run. I should not be starting this far forward. York Park Run is one and a half laps to the tarmac service road around the inside of the race course. It's very flat with few turns making it very fast. Oh, 21 minute pace. Just... It's definitely a course that has PB potential. Current pace, we just sat at 6.40 and we're almost half a but unfortunately, we weren't breaking any records today, although I have broken all promises to myself that I was going to ease off today. I won 6.40, so just a little bit ahead, 21 pace. So that's a half lap done, and we've got one full lap to go now. Breathing is not overly great. Thank you. Halfway. Up, now. up until now, I'd been ahead of the 21 pacer. I'm not keeping up today. It's a warm one today. Final number two, 658. I completely died on that one. Well, now let's try the same for the 22 pacer. I am ahead of him. I'm not buying him. Thank you to the guy who offered to film me in the last mile. I hope your fell race went well. Right, not far to go now. The grandstand is back in view and the finish is near. Here we go, final straight. Just hit three miles. Mile three, seven, eleven. Still no sign of the 22 pace there. Oh, here we go. Finish tokens coming up. Thank you. There we go. Go, Rory. Great running, well done. So pleased. Doesn't matter about my time today. The fact that Rory was still running at the finish there means, hopefully, fingers crossed, his calf is okay. While well, you were still running, we went to do 10 minute miling. Yeah. We're doing like. Oh, that old story. It's probably the first run out of the whole year that's actually been properly hot. But because we've not acclimatised to it, it's not really that hot, but because it's come out of nowhere, it definitely makes a big difference in how you feel when you're running. Probably couldn't have done that a few days ago. Running with a cold, breathing is terrible. So, a bit like last week, first mile really good, and then just died off on those last two miles. But it's another run. Got my Y ticked off on my park run alphabet and we both survived today's run. I'm still on the start line today and then Dave comes and says hello and he is from where? Also Warsaw. Warsaw, so that's where we ran last <laughs> week. Yeah. So what are the chances of that meeting yeah. someone on the start line? So that is uh, Dave's local. Hiya. Hiya. Well, that's York Park Run done and dusted. Not quite executed the way that either of us had hoped, but nevertheless, we both survived it. All eyes are now focused on next Saturday. Got a real big and fun race that we have entered for next week. Really looking forward to doing that and 
uh, hopefully all the colds and the niggles, the calf issues will all be pushed aside and we can both go and have a, a really good run. But thank you so much for joining us on our York Park Run visit today. Uh, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you next time. Was seven days enough to recover for the Bridge Ultra? Find out in my race video out next week.